Hey guys, I'm LB, and uh, we are continuing playing Rename. We initially started this in the live stream on Friday. There's a link in the description so you can watch the beginning of it. Uh, we didn't accomplish much though. We we really did not accomplish much at all. Uh, I managed to get a cube there, and then I've been stuck for the rest of the map, and I basically just talked about a bunch of stuff before escaping the map. But so, we're up here now. We have a portal there and a portal there. And I think Libby Bapa just said it's something about portal management. I'm pretty sure I want to keep a portal in there at all times. Either there, or there. It doesn't really matter too much. So, I think the first things first is... I'm gonna jump... over to here. When I- actually I can just jump right now, yeah. I don't even need to time it or anything. I can do that. That fizzles... that. Come on, fall in there, please. And so right now, this should be on an infinite... death loop. The cube should constantly respawn... and it'll either fall there if it doesn't have velocity, or it'll fall there if it does. So what I think we want to do... Something like that. I think we want to use the funnel to stop it. That's my guess. I really have no other ideas other than that. Okay, that was a bit too soon. Yeah, okay. I sort of get it now. Basically, as soon as we see it go through the portal over here... Ah, oh, come on! Oh, that was almost right. Uh... Uh... There we go. Come on, now. There we go. Alright, that is something. That is something to save over. Let's save and continue. So now we can hop in here. Ooh, that was close. We, we have the cube here now, which allows us... to walk... on this part, I think. Yeah. Yeah, okay, so now... that gives us access to... this. I don't know which in which side we want it to be on, though. We want the portal to be this way? Perhaps? Now, let's see, I need to take this cube with me. So we've accomplished that, at the very least. Now the question is... How... to do... this part. I think... potentially... Might just need to juggle the cube a bit. Maybe this will work. Hey! Presto, look at that! Amazing! Right. So I did have it in the proper orientation. Okay, so... I think now this is definitely something we're saving over. Holy crap, Constica, this is... Yeah. Well, once I got past... figuring out what to do... Also, why is my game lagging? That's weird. Once I got past figuring out what to do with, uh, this and getting the cube there and all that... Now things are starting to make sense. I think Tomsica said this was supposedly easy, but I- th I think it's quite challenging, actually. These are things that I wouldn't normally think to do in maps. Right. So. Oh yeah, there's that gel dropper up there that we still haven't figured out yet. So we've got this situation covered. <laughs> it's even got the... Oh no, that's actually got the light on both sides, but yeah, so we've got this. We think we want to bootstrap the laser, would be my guess. But if we bootstrap the laser, hold on, what else... What else is there to see and do over here? How do we get to the exit? Right, there's that. And that happens to be... two blocks up. And there's this magical, mysterious gel dropper here. I'm not sure why it's sequestered in such a way that we can't see what the signage is on it. But my guess is that it's gonna drop a bounce gel here, and we're gonna bounce up onto a light bridge... to get to the exit. Because we do have we do have an open door policy. Yeah, I think so. 
Now the question is, how do we activate that gel dropper? Hmm. Yeah, so that laser we won't need anymore. If we bootstrap it. But the thing is, how we get out if we bootstrap it? Uh, hmm. I'm gonna save here, and... Yeah, we're just gonna... We're gonna cross over here, and what happens if... Oh, yeah! The light bridge, totally forgot. Wasn't that useful. Yep, don't need that anymore. So then... Maybe we can use the laser cube on this platform to just keep it bootstrapped. Oh! Oh! I got lucky there. That- that almost went very badly. Let's, uh, I think I need to use this first. Oh, crap. Don't do this to me. Okay. Hold on a second. Okay. Let's see here. I think we can do this. Yes! Okay. Oh, 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 okay. Whew! Ha ha ha! Yes. We've done that. Okay. Now we can walk along here. Yes, I was so tempted to look at Prototype Solution video, but I'm glad that I looked around a bit longer before giving up. So when does this happen, I wonder? Hmm... We have a light bridge now. Do we even need portals in there anymore? I don't think so. Probably not. I think we're done with that area. Unless... Oh no... Maybe... Maybe we need to bounce on this gel, and then come out of that floor portal surface, and then, like, use the light bridge to catch ourselves or something? How would that work, though? Is that even something I can do? Is the question. But we've- we've saved here, so, uh... Oh crap, well... <laughs> Let's... Let's just load the quick save where I'm standing up there on that platform, because I might have needed to jump off on the platform where the cube spawns. Hmm. Alright. Let's see here. I don't think we can make this jump, though. I think we tested this on stream. Let's- let's- let's try that again. Yeah, you definitely can't make that jump. Okay, so that's out of the question. That's not how we're supposed to get there. I guess we could just... I need to keep a portal in there is the thing. Cause if I do this... Yeah, that goes away. Have we used that portal surface yet? I don't think we have. I'm pretty sure we have not used that portal surface yet. That's the thing that confuses me, though. Because if I want to have access to that, I need to keep a portal in there so I can't just, like, light bridge myself over there. And then when I'm actually... When I'm actually inside over here... I don't really have access to much in the way of anything. Oh, and I can't even get here anymore, that's right. Maybe that isn't what I have to do then. Well then what do I have to do? Do I have to like, hope for an Ex Machina or something? Not particularly helpful. Huh. 
So here's the other thing, we could use the funnel, if I get over there, which, uh... Let's pretend that I didn't just shoot my green portal like that. Let's put that back there. Just cause it's faster than loading a quick save, so let's, uh... Let's go over here, and now we can shoot our green portal. Yeah, so we do that. Oh crap, don't- don't you do that to me, game. Don't you do that to me. And... This gets us... the requisite height. But then we can't see... Can't see the portal surface anymore that we need. Can we? Or maybe we can. I don't think that's intended, though. I think we're- oh! What happened there? Oh, I got- I escaped from where the dropper is. Oh yeah, that's- that's no. No, 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 no. Unless- oh! Holy crap, yeah. Wait, what, speed gel? Why is that all up with I guess there must be a trigger here. Okay then. Interesting. <laughs> so that's what the Ex Machina is. Oh, Tonsica. Oh, Tonsica. Alright, well guys, as always, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it, and I'll see you all in another video. Man, what a map. <laughs>